Yep. Back out. Day two. And we're in the lakes. Like, can I, I can't even do a Geordie accent. What's the matter with this? Aye, uh, so same as last week. Got Mark there. Tin mug adventures. Steve's wild camping. And him. He's here. Him. Animal. Dogs are animals, right, aren't they? Dogs are animals. Um, we're heading up the fells. We were over, way over the back of there the other week. And this week we're up here. I think we've come here before. A few, I think it was last year, we camped here. Beautiful sunset. I remember it well. We were going to go, I think, an extra two kilometres from where we're going to stop. But I'm absolutely knackered. I was up dead early this morning. That snow, the snow off the last video, coming in the tent, woke us up quarter past five. So anyway, Mark's been backwards and forwards to the lakes. I think this is, was his third trip up here this week. Plus I've been working hard. Woe is me. Poor me. Just want sympathy. <laughs> anyway, dog's gonna start going crazy now because the sheep. Right on cue. Right on cue. Absolutely knackered. Going up these high, these paths. We're following the map. It keeps putting me past the paths we need to be on. According to the map, this is the right way. Like. Oh crap. I just got a tent up before the rain comes. Hopefully. There we go. We've reached the top. We were going to go over there, like. But we're all bloody knackered. That's the back of them fells again. Which one we were at last week? It was over there, wasn't it? There's a big one at the back there. There's the scar fells, and then there's not. That's where we were last week. We have camped here before, like... If you remember the video where I put the sunset and the James Bond music over it, that was that was here. There's not going to be any of that, like, is there? Any sunset? I wouldn't have thought. You never know, you never know what will happen. Alright, we're going to get set up and uh, I'm going to get my tea on because I'm uh, pretty hungry. Set up. Both. Green bag, isn't it? That was a bit chilly last night, like that red bag. Still, oh, look at the rain over there coming. Oh, it's coming over here. We're gonna get hit. So, Mark's in his red beacon. His red beacon of light. I see what's coming over our way. Yeah. Big old storm. And Steve's in the uh, top tent. Um, top tent. Spitfire. Spitfire. What's it called? Stratosphere. Stratosphere. One. Stratosphere one. It's nice. Not bad. Nice material. Quite solid. Not as good as the Sulu. Not as good as the Zalu. But nonetheless, nice tent. Two doors. <coughs> There's Mark with the uh, badly behaved dog. Do you like them? Nice, nice. Look at that coming here. Uh, Jack, oh, go. Nice. Come here. You're going to have big dogs. Alright, Dean is moonwalking dog. Don't, it's destroying the, the vegetarian. Vegetarians. <laughs> destroying the vegetarian. The vegetation, stop it. Hey, that's enough. This is the top anyway. Probably showing you around this before. Little, uh, little chair. Seat to sit on later. Shivering. 
This is the top here, gives you all the miles. Everything you need to know. I think that is going that way. So we might be alright. Yeah, it's definitely not coming over here. Dog's crackers like. <laughs> right, so we're all set up. Uh, time lapses, what do you reckon? A bit sick of doing time lapses now. Ah, we'll stick one on anyway. Tea time again. This time, I've got a great big sirloin steak. How is that? Big in that leg. Yeah, I'm gonna have that with some of the old mushrooms, with the garlic butter, and a bit of peppercorn sauce. No, too elaborate. Even the beers are just the same supermarket beers again. Let's get that pan nice and hot. Got my grip glove. Still forgot me, I still can't find that bloody hot grip somewhere. Wait, I'll just get another one. Right, so, I'll get on with this. First side done. Put a bit of seasoning on. That was 15 quid, that. Throwing all over the place again. Mushrooms have entered the building. As you can see in the pan. No, I'm not going to say it. <laughs> it's tight for space. There's not a great amount of space in the pan. You could even say it. No, I'm not saying it. I say it every time. Right, just let them reduce it down a bit and then hide the sauce on. Nearly done. So this is resting that. And this is mushrooms nice. Let them with a bit of brown on. Nice colour. Just catching on the pan, that's how I like them. And then ready to pour the sauce in. Morrison's quid. It's really nice as well. Dog smelling the steak. It's not getting me. Where there's food. <laughs> Are you there's food? The dogs there and wait for you. I don't know. Aye, the wind drops. Nice. Mm. Nice and the wind drops. Lovely. I'm going to demolish this. That's it, really. Well, we'll just come out for a little wander from the, the camp. The camp's way back over there. About a mile, isn't it? Steve's just uh, doing a bit of admin. This is me, Mark. We've come to the, the hut. It's just over a mile, Candy. Just over a mile. Hasn't, hasn't taken me long, has it? No, no. I mean, it's all downhill. We've got to walk all the way back up. Lingy hut. 18 minutes. 18 minutes to do a mile. Beat that more, Farah. Look how it's been tied down. Do you think it gets rough out here? No, it's, it's a bit dropping. Go and see if it's open. Yeah, you can still look from the outside, I think. Knock on the door in case there's somebody in there. Come knock on the door. There won't be if we've bolted it. Ah. 
Go on, Ken. Oh, just stop the extra minute. Just leave Steve up there. And I'll tell him. This used to be, this platform used to be full across the gate, and that was it. That was it, platform, and then this thing was over. Ah, it's cunning, isn't it? Yeah. It's not very big, you have to be really close. And there's a the shovel there, I don't know what the shovel for. That's your view. There's a view of you, night tonight um, a few beers a uh, bit crack and some uh, dancing a bit mad carry on so what we're gonna do is we're gonna put the night lapse out see if that works it might work or it might not let's see let's see how it goes and uh, well, we'll see you tomorrow Bill etc Skylark. Oh, Skylark. I was wrong. It's been a mad carry on last night. No daft. Nobody was injured. Maybe somebody was injured. But uh, it wasn't my fault. Nothing to do with me. The wind turned, the, turn, the wind's coming in this way now. It was behind us when I set the tent up. It turned right round and come in the tent. So maybe I'm going to get packed away. It's up there, It's about 8 o'clock now. Uh, uh, right, right, let's get packing. Let's get packing. Let's have a pack up. This is how I pack up. Clouds. I think we're just about ready to pack up and go. The tent was bone dry. Lovely. Love it when a tent's dry. Right, see you right well, we're nearly back. Just by them houses there. It's raining now. Big black clouds. Look at the clouds. We've got away with it. So, anything to add? It was rubbish, I'm not doing it anymore. Right. I thought it was terrible, mate. Good. I enjoyed it this time. Did you? That was an average one last week. Oh, you can come again. It was average. <laughs> <laughs> Anything to add? I think we've got an average. Baxter, anything to say? <laughs> Get off your face. It was a cold one, though, wasn't it? Go oh, it was freezing last night, wasn't it? No, it was a good night, it was a brilliant yeah. night. <clears throat> it wasn't, like. It's rubbish. I wasn't even joking about being rubbish. So, we'll see you on the next one, whenever, wherever. As Shakira once said. <laughs> Shakira, Shakira. Yeah. <laughs>